This is how we insulate our beehives, David and Susan style, in Tiverton, Rhode Island. This is one inch styrofoam board insulation, and I have attached bee thickness pieces of wood with hot glue. This piece fits on the back, and uh, I'm going to use this, um, this bit of duct tape to hold it in place. Next, the side panel. First, I tape it to the back. And another piece of duct tape. Hold it in place. Join the side and the back with packaging tape. Get over the second side. Side. Uh, the back is as wide as the box, plus three quarter inches for the B space sticks. We're getting company. The sides are joined, and this will waterproof it and keep the air from flowing out the top. We want to keep the warm air around the hive and not escaping except through the vent in the front. A spot of tape that we have there. Now we'll go around to the front. Where the vent is, I'm going to carve a V-shaped notch that slopes outward for rain to escape. No, they don't like that. They don't understand. It's all for them. because it's upside down. We'll make a second V-shaped notch. Now they can get in and out if they like. This won't make any difference. And what's the piece on the bottom there? In front? This will go underneath. A little more loosely so that if any water does get in, it could get out. Seal it up with duct tape. Close the other side. <clears throat> There's a little hood made out of the, the uh, seal on a coffee lid, a coffee can, and it has the form of a kind of a beak. For a cool gray 40 degree day in Rhode Island, the bees are still flying around. And we're essentially done. Other than taping around the entire sides of the 
upper styrofoam as the other hides are. Here you can see the, uh, we'll pull that a little tighter. That's where the bee sticks is. And once a month on a very nice day in the winter, we go out and quickly work together to take off the tape, put in extra fondant as needed, and they're good to go for another month or two until the we spring. Open it. We'll just cut along the tape like that and lift it up. Okay. 